You know, just uh, it's another Saturday, Saturday morning with popping gangsters ready. I'm gonna go and get into a fight with the cop. a little too much. Playing with my Nerf gun. Being my awesome Pokey John card. Oh my god, I got to do Snapchat. Taco Bell. He was wearing like a scarf man. Weird stuff. Y'all don't know me. I like to shoot. brush the good old tates that I there's something crawling down my leg. I don't know what it is. It's supposed to be American. Yeah. Yep, yep. Mom bought Mom bought me. Oh with my gun. We all good. What we do in the hood, man. Bang, bang. Wow. Dude, old, old Ross Bucket. I just remember this, this gun doesn't doesn't work. Oh. Time to go play some basketball, boys. Oh. Getting wet here. Let's go. Here we are, Rick Rhymes and his posse of being rambunctious playing some good old basketball. He especially likes to play rough with one of his young little buddies named Chaplin. They supposed 
great-grandson of the great actor Charlie Chaplin. And part of his group, Ricky's playing with a good old pal of his from the great uh, China land, a Mr. Steve-O. And on Drew's team we have a good basketball player himself who thinks that he's the next uh, LeBron James, Mr. Just Fish. He's a little swishy sometimes, but, you know. But Rick and Drew go back a long ways. Drew is Rick's blackest friend that he knows, even though he's part white, but. They are indeed a rough little tag group. They've always fought, and they will always fight. Especially in basketball, Drew thinks that he is the incarnation of Steph Curry. But Rick over here, acting like Steve Urkel playing, has no skill whatsoever. But anyways, Seriously, like, Drew called me this morning, and he was like, you're going to Bloomington, right? So, he was like, whenever we were at the park, I was thinking, like, made a hole in the basketball whenever I kicked it. I'm like, you idiot. And I'm like, get your own thing, basketball. <laughs> yeah, I called Rick. I freaking screwed that guy. I called Rick and told him, like, don't beat sticking up. Drew's sticking up, but <laughs> then what happened? I shot him. Just kidding, just kidding. <laughs> but, yeah, I... It's getting ridiculous. Rick? Oh. Yeah, uh... I'm not gonna get a stick of basketball for Drew. Exactly. Yeah, I'm yeah, that is facts, too. I'm gonna get his own thing basketball. Twice, actually. Twice. Oh. John says three times. Yeah? No. Uh. Oh. Uh, uh, I think we went like. No, we're, uh, we're just uh, about to turn into the hall, but we took a longer way than I guess. Alright, do we need cat or something? Yeah. Why well, get a stick of basketball? I mean, you can get a stick of. Fidget spinner. Look at this thing move. Ex John Clay, cuz. Oh my gosh, it's so quick. Almost 40 seconds, I think it's good. <laughs> 40 seconds by screen. How did he do it? How do I... I, I just like literally just like spun it and it keeps spinning. Bunch of feet, first born baby. Yeah. I mean, Rick Stickin said you didn't get a stinking job. What do you have to say about that? Well, I say to Rick, uh, I don't want to miss the beginning of musical for a freaking job, dog. I mean, Drew's got like six jobs, Rick's got a job, but you and I are sitting here without any jobs, but at least like, at least we both go and buy our own stick of basketball. Yeah, yeah. yeah, at least I don't, uh, stick and go to like, shoot a ball, and then after I get, you know, my own rebound, I go and kick the ball, and Rick has to like, I don't know, you like kick it up. You should have been there with the legs. Freaking Rick Ryan. 